Shalom of Racha, Mirushalayim, Irakodesh. Parashat Mas'e. The Torah section of this week, Parashat Mas'e, deals with the many journeys of the Jewish people as they traveled from Egypt to Israel. The Torah enumerates the 42 stations of this great adventure and provides us with a long, detailed list of the names of each of the temporary dwelling places of our nation. Although significant in and of itself, this particular portion in the 33rd chapter of the book of Numbers may also be read as a symbolic list of the journeys of each of us as we attempt to leave our own personal land of Mitzrayim, our own levels of constriction and imperfection, on the road to our great personal promised land, to the Eretz Yisrael, that each one of us seeks to improve his or her life and ultimately actualizes this goal. We journey from Egypt, conceptual Egypt, to Israel, to conceptual Israel. The message of Parashat Mas'e may mean that we are enjoined to understand that very often this journey is not attainable in an immediate way. Yes, we want to accomplish A, B, C, but maybe, maybe we too have to go through 42 different levels of roads and detours until we ultimately get there. The Mas'ei, the Masa'ot of Am Yisrael are there to teach us levels of patience, levels of hope in our own life's journeys. So many people, unfortunately, give up in the middle of the trip. For they went on their journey, and they want to see the immediate result. Parashat Mas'e teaches that we will eventually get there, but sometimes it takes many pathways, many roads, and many stops on the way. Our great rabbis teach in Tractate Berachot, it's on the very last page of the Tractate, it's page 64a, Amar Rabbi Avin Halevi, Kol Hadohek et Sha'a, Sha'a Dohakto. Someone who forces something to happen at the exact moment that he or she wants it to happen. Dohek et Sha'a. I want it now, immediately. Will often be unsuccessful. The person forcing the time will often be forced back by that very time. You will get there. But study Parashat Mas'e. Anyone involved in sowing and planting knows that one cannot expect to see immediate positive results to his or her activities in planting. For the secret of this world is connected to the secret of Parashat Mas'e. The loving couple who are ever so excited that they will be blessed with a baby are taught through the Mas'e journeys of pregnancy that the baby is not an immediate happening. First trimester, second trimester, third trimester, Mas'e! The divine secret is connected to Mas'e. Sometimes in life, 
we are privileged to meet certain individuals who seem so well accomplished in their respective professions. We should, however, recall that that which we see in them today wasn't always that way. The rabbis contrast the attitude of the pikeh, the attitude of the wise individual, as compared to the attitude of the tipesh, the one who is not yet wise. The tipesh fool sees the vastness of the Torah system. So far, Amati, in the book of Job, chapter 11, verse 9, speaks of the Torah wisdom as being aruka me'eretz midah urechava miniyam. The wisdom of Torah is aruka me'eretz midah. It's measures longer than the earth. Urechava miniyam. And is wider than seas and oceans. The tipesh, the unwise one, says, Miyachol umarata Torah. Is it possible to master Torah? The pikeach, wise individual, says the Midrash, takes a different approach. He or she has mastered parashat mas'eh. Misha pikeach, mahu omer? Hareni shoneh shte halachot ayom, shte halachot mahar, ad shani shoneh, kol Torah kula. I will connect myself to the mas'eh journeys of Torah. It won't happen overnight, but I'll eventually master it. The Pikeach has mastered Parashat Masay and has studied of the many ups and downs of the journeys of the Jewish people and understands that everybody has ups and downs, the ins and the outs. The Jewish people eventually get to the land of Israel and each of us will get to the promised land. But we have to go through Parashat Masay. According to certain schools of religious Torah thought and tradition, the key to understanding Mashiach, the key to understanding redemption, is also connected to Parashat Mas'eh. Many of us dream of an instant Mashiach, instant redemption, instant Tikkun Olam. We often feel despondent when we don't yet see it. Mas'e means that the roads to Mashiach may have at least 42 pauses on the way. Keep going! We're almost there! A person traveling in a long, dark tunnel will often experience turn after turn and may sometimes get the feeling that they'll be in this tunnel forever. That's not true. One more turn, and you're out of the tunnel. Parashat Mas'ei is coming to an end. May the many Mas'ei B'nai Yisrael May the many journeys and travels of the Jewish people, the experiences of our nation, through so many various levels of challenges, may the Masay, the collective Masay of our nation, lead us today to the perfected state of perfected lives. May all the Masay journeys in your lives, in our lives, in the lives of the entire Jewish people, in the lives of the entire world. May they elevate each person and may they take them to the promised land, to the levels of their expectation. We hope that we can internalize the lessons of Masay to ultimately get where we're trying to go. Thank you so much for listening. Oh, for sure. Thank you. Yes, yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey, Bobby.